is an event that has been years in the making. This Thanksgiving at the Moda Center and Memorial Coliseum is the kickoff of PK80, a huge college basketball tournament in honor, of course, of Nike co-founder Phil Knight. So with us right now, we have Dwayne Hankins, Chief Marketing Officer with the Trailblazers and the Rose Quarter, and Chris Oxley, Senior Vice President, Venue Operations with Portland Trailblazers and the Rose Quarter. Very important things, of course, you've got your official <laughs> PK80 jackets on already. It kicks off this Thursday. Now, we always hear especially in Oregon where we love sports, we hear about lots of basketball tournaments, but this is really one of a kind, the first time it's happening, right? This is not only the first time, but the only time. Uh, to have 16 teams from all over the country of this caliber play in Portland, uh, one event, it's just, it's unheard of. The, we, don't, we don't get this kind of opportunity very often. Yeah. yeah. But, oh, no, what were you yeah, it's, the, it's the biggest event we've, we've definitely ever had. We tried to go back and talk through what it might have been, and the Dream Team in 92 come playing at the Veterans Memorial Coliseum was probably the last time we had anything of this caliber. So. And it is all in honor of Phil Knight, his 80th birthday coming up. I looked it up. It's in February, which is during yep. the Olympics, so maybe he wants to get a head start and celebrate Thanksgiving weekend. Well, we couldn't schedule the uh, NCAA uh, season around mm -hmm. his, birth his birthday, <laughs> but uh, we gave it a shot. So it's a great preseason tournament, pre-conference tournament, and, and a great opportunity for us to recognize Mr. Knight for all he's done for collegiate basketball and the sport. Uh, these teams coming together and these coaches, it's, it's a unique opportunity. And, and you know, without Mr. Knight, you know, a lot of the things that happen in these universities wouldn't have been possible. And this really has been years to just be able to schedule it and organize it and get it off the ground? Mm -hmm. Four years. Wow. I've, I've been at it for over four years. You've got to get these teams uh, in the schedule at least two years out in order to fit them into the tournament. So yeah, four years in the making. So someone started college, graduated college <laughs> in the time that it took. Wow, that's awesome. That's right, that's right. Now, of course, since you have Phil Knight and Nike involved, there are some sp spiffy new uniforms, right, sure. for everybody? Absolutely. <laughs> they're pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, they're great uniforms. I think Nike obviously wanted to do something special and create you know, uniforms that were just for this tournament. So there's a lot of great things that are obviously going to be on display at the tournament. New uniforms, uh, new courts that were built specifically just for this, and it should be a lot of fun. Wow, new courts in both of those? Both arenas. Wow. Coliseum as well. Now, people can still get tickets. It's pkinvitational.com slash tickets, and there are still some available? For sure. We, we planned around the holiday weekend knowing that folks are going to be have their plans for Thursday, even though we're playing basketball. We wanted to make sure the tickets were available. You know, Friday afternoon, you're ready to get out of the house. Sunday, come and check out some great basketball. Uh, we have tickets available, and we're ready, ready to bring people in. And it is 16 teams, and in that there are lots of Oregon, Oregon representations, right? Mm -hmm. 16, yeah, 16 teams, 24 games. Wow. Like if you think about an NCAA event during the first and second round, which we do all the time, that's just six games. This is 24 games over three days and two, two full arenas. It's a, it's a monumental effort. Do you have any highlights, any big games that people should look forward to and really try to get a ticket if they can? Well, I think to just, just come see the Ducks play is going to be great. Uh, there's going to be great basketball. We've got t uh, four of the top ten teams in the country playing. Uh, Arkansas is playing really good basketball at the moment. Uh, Duke, North Carolina, Oregon, UConn, Michigan State, obviously. Uh, you can't go wrong. And if people can't get tickets or if they're out of town, can they watch elsewhere? Yep, both games will be available, uh, ESPN, ESPN U. Yeah, so the entire suite of, of ESPN networks will carry every game, wow. so you can't miss it. Clearly ESPN knows the name of Phil Knight oh, and sure. gives it some attention. Sure. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you guys Absolutely. so much thank again. You. Thursday, Friday, and Sunday. Sunday. Saturday, as you mentioned, Civil War, Day of right. Rest <laughs> for basketball. <laughs> thank right. you. PK80, first one. We'll be right back.